insane. It was my first race where I had my first massive swim panic. And when I got out of the water, all the women and the uh, back performance staff and, and volunteers cheered for me as if I was winning the entire race. And I can't thank you enough for showing me all the encouragement, the strength, the womanhood, and the power to just keep moving forward. And um, it's an outstanding race. Thank you so much. Hey, Title IX athletes, Nancy Gomes here. Welcome to Race Week. Title IX is one of my favorite races for so many reasons, but two things it means to me are courage and inspiration. The courage that each and every one of you badass ladies had to pick this big goal and to work hard to achieve it, and the inspiration that will come from knowing that you pushed your limits and can proudly cross that finish line. So many of you for the first time. So I'm sad we won't be together on race day. I want you to go out and crush your race. Have a great race, and I'll see you back in Hopkinton next year. triathlon was the second triathlon I ever did and I was so struck by how wonderfully supportive the women there were and all the staff and the positive energy of the event and the really nice size um, it didn't feel like you were lost in a sea of women it felt just like you were in a big hug <laughs> uh, I as a newbie triathlete I found people to answer all my questions and help me out, and I met people who would become my teammates, so I'm now director of Team and Vision. I've been doing Title IX for, wow, I think like 11 years, 12 years. This would be probably my 12th or 13th, and uh, it changed my life, and for the better. <laughs> and I can't wait to come back next year and see all those smiling faces and help all those other women and uh, get another water bottle. <laughs>